This happened a very long time ago, and it was at night time. Eventually, me and my sister and my mom were in a ca in a taxi or Uber or a cab, whatever it was. I don't really remember because, like I said, this happened a very long time ago. We were in a car, and then the uh, I I think it was like a girl or a boy in the. I think it was like a driver, like a girl or a boy, the driver. I don't know, but it was just some sort of person. And it had these weird songs on the radio that I sometimes, uh, some of them I really didn't like. So, eventually, I, I start, I start thinking about something, and then all of a sudden I get interrupted by this radio sound. Um, it's like... It was just n not a music. It was like no music. It was not. It was like a sound, but it wasn't music. <laughs> it starts playing something like Josephine, Josephine, Josephine. It was repeatedly saying it three times in the on the radio. It was repeatedly saying my mom's real name three times in a singing voice, and I got so freaked out. Even my mom asked my sister about it. So the story also happened a very long time ago. It happened like in 2020 or 2019 or 2018. And I was like uh, nine years old. So I was playing Among Us that night. I got bored, so I hopped on a phone or a tablet to play some Among Us. And then, um, uh, like, uh, uh, it was just like a bunch of, it was just like me with a bunch of people and a weird ho- the weird host of the game, the weird host of the room, just like being weird. His skin, his Among Us skin was like a little bit brownish yellow, and he had a leaf hat. And then, when we were playing, <clears throat> tons of people got voted out and stuff, and then, after the game, the game went normal, but after the game, everybody started leaving. After the rounds, everyone starts leaving. And then, it was only me, and the, it was only me, and the, 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 the host, the weird host of the room, and then, I got a chat, I got a notification from a chat, in the Among Us chat, so I opened it up, and he said, where do you live, and then I said something, that wasn't my address, that, I said, it wasn't my address, I, j nothing my, of my address, it wasn't even similar to my address, I just said something weird back to him, and then, after when I said something weird back to him, then he said, Again, where do you live, but this time in, in all capitals. So that's when I got freaked out and left the game. And I told my dad, my sister, and my mom everything. Story 3, final story. This is the freakiest story of them all. One t one time, this happened one night ago. It was 2001. It happened in 2021. I was I was 10 years old. I was 10 years old, and eventually I was I was playing people playground on my computer. In my room with the lights off. It was night out. It happened a long time ago. I was playing people playground on my computer with the lights off while dad was just walking around the house with his boots on my dad was just walking around the house with his boots on and a hoodie on because and because he was waiting for somebody to come and sell and and get the furniture that he was selling so after that i i start like start um, like Playing people playground, killing a bunch of people, having fun, downloading mods, and then all of a sudden, something caught my eye. Something that got me really weirded out. I saw that dad was nowhere to be seen. I mean, like, dad wasn't, 
walking around. I didn't hear his footsteps. I didn't hear him talking. I didn't see him walking around my room or walking past the hallway nowhere. So after I played a couple of games of People Playground, I decided to close my computer, shut down my computer, go outside and investigate. I remember that the living room lights were still on, so I saw that Dad was <coughs> um was hiding in the side of the orange closet, and then I I came up to him and said, "Hey, Dad, why are you doing? I mean, hey, Dad, why are you?" Why are you, hmm, like, why are you hiding inside of there? And he said that, shh, I don't know who's, I don't know who was knocking on the window. Someone was knocking on the window. I didn't know who it is. I didn't answer it. And then I got so freaked out, like, why can't you just answer it and see who it was? And then it's like he... It's like he didn't answer to see who. It's like he's. Well, he was just telling me that. He was saying that he didn't know who it was and he didn't want to answer it. I just figured it was the upstairs people trying to get in or need help. But he, they never just like yelled it out. And I knew it wasn't CJ, my sister CJ, and my friend Dane, because they said they couldn't come this night. So, that's it.